Oh. Alright, there we go, we did it! My last vehicle was wrecked in a crash. This is my new design. More durable and faster. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this thing, this is awesome. You sent me an email, Nancy? Aw, oh, thank you, I'll check it out later, I appreciate that. You are too kind. Darn it! There's no more heat tonight. Those are special fuel crystals, blue in color. I need to find some or the vehicle won't start. What about this energy orb? No. That energy orb is not what we need. Look at this train. This train looks amazing. So, what do we got here? Can we go back to our friend here, our shopper friend? Let's go back and see if we can give her the box. Hello? Oh, what's this? Is this my box? My parents were supposed to send me this decorative box, but the mail coach was lost due to the bad weather. Thank you, my dear. Here, take this reward. Yes. <gasps> six. So we, oh, we're still six short. Can't you give us a discount? But we're like your only shopper. Oh man, we're not ready to buy that cool outfit. We're gonna have to stick around in our Care Bear outfit here. Yeah, they're very pretty ladies. All the pretty ladies are in this game. So, uh, let's see what our map says here. It definitely says I gotta go back here. I'm not sure if this would go here. Let's try. Oh, it certainly does. And we found the Flask of Essence, which is what we've been looking for. So, wheat. I don't think the tongs are gonna work here. No, okay. It's a message. It's the Balisk Venom. Saliva of a mythical creature taken in battle and mixed with the blood of a wounded Balisk. Highly valued by Dark Knights and Alchemists, the former uses the acid to poison their victims, while the latter make omnivorous acid for out of it. So I think we're going to use it to get into this gate over here. It looks like the Goodnight Bear. Is that what that looks like? I'm not all up on my... Uh, Care Bears, but uh, sure. She was uh, chillaxing on her uh, couch there watching Netflix when uh, she was thrust into this adventure. We have acid! Oh, I like popcorn with extra butter too. Nom nom. We're already talking about food. We're only an hour in. <laughs> We're already talking about food. You guys are awesome. Let's dive into this broken down tower here. Uh, the weather here in the Toronto area is in the mid 20s, low 20s to mid 20s. It's still warm. Elsewhere in Canada, we've got snow. That's just the way it works. Got a lever, lever. Looks like we're gonna have to come up with something there. I don't know if this will work. Let's try. Yes, it does. Excellent. I don't know if this... No, that's a key. It requires a key. So... These circles need to be positioned correctly, but I don't know what to do. I'll take that. I think we need to put a magnifying glass here. Or not. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> wow, we lit it. We lit it. We're gonna get some rope and make a ladder here. Once we find the rope. 
Hmm. What do we got? We need the code, which I assume is that piece of paper there. For me, like, when it comes to fast food, too much of it is where I kind of get into trouble here. Oh, I see. That comes with me, does it? Anything in moderation can be good, but it's when you go overboard it becomes bad. Why do I need a lamp? Oh, there's our rope. Okay. Now we got a ladder. Put somewhere. It's dark in here. I love the way they do these interactive scenes. These are great. Crystal goes there. Hit the green button, and we have the code! Oh, we don't have jack-in-the-box around this neck of the woods. Well, that's good. And that one's gotta be... Um, there it is. Key, please! We got some heat night. Do the milkshakes bring all the boys to the yard? Fantastic! We found some heat night for my car. Yeah, we got the heat night. Let's go ahead and put that in here. I gotta light it up, up, up. Let's go on our train! Hold on tight! All aboard! Goodness, what happened? What happened? Oh my gosh. There's jam everywhere. What did he do? Look at all the scratches everywhere. I suppose this is the druid from Maroon Squad. This guy is dressed like a druid from the guild. I think he's from Marin Squad. What is that beast? The same kind attacked me in the dark woods. It's a Fenron, a wolf, enslaved by the ice cold power. Seems they are both dead. Fulner, we need to move on. You're right. Now we go up. I just need to lower the bridges with the mechanism up there. Oh, yes. One more thing. It's bitter cold up there on the surface. We can't leave if you're not dressed properly. Yeah, they both ended up killing each other in this sad situation. But you know what? We're going to totally take the dead man's money. Because we got to get... buy clothes. We're going to buy some pretty winter clothes. That's a good thing. Apparently we can't go any further until we buy winter clothes. Uh... Restore the broken... Oh, I see. This is kind of neat. We're totally doing it. I love the sound effects for this. Very satisfying. They make a good s ker thud sound. Oh, 
Buy the outfit quick! <laughs> we will! We will buy the outfit. Fuller! Dwarf and mechanic who prefers a hermit lifestyle mostly in the abandoned mines that stretch under the plains. He builds vehicles from anything he can find, which he uses to travel quickly between provinces. In the Chronicles of the Lost Lands, Fulner is mentioned for the first time upon the appearance of the Black Horseman as a faithful apprentice and guardian of Susan the War Maiden. By the way, that's the character we play. We are Susan the War Maiden, which is a great name. I like that. The second mention is in the archives of the Druid Guild, where he bought, brought the half-dead Moran to the village. Uh-huh. So, we've got levers and such. So I don't think we're quite ready yet. Oh, I bet you that goes there, doesn't it? But, oh, it looks like we do have a gear. But I don't think we know how to do this, though. Oh, maybe we do. Aha! Bridges are fixed. I think. I don't think we can go any further, though. We can't go into yeah, the frozen not. mountains without some warm clothing. It's so cold there that you'll freeze in an instant. Okay, okay. I was just checking. I was just checking. Ooh, it looks like we have a morphing object here that we have not found. Or here either. I don't know where this morphing object is. It can be quite tiny in this game. Alright, let's go back then. It is really that cold, yes. She's going to get some snow clothes. We're going to get all fancy now. Check this out. Although I am a little sad to see the uh, Care Bear t-shirt disappear. It is time. Before. Quick. Take a screen cap. That's our before. Care Bear pajamas. Boom. There is our after. <laughs> Why does it look like our hair color changed? Man, we are ready for adventure now. She is totally looking adventure-y. I don't think that's a real word, but look at her. Great outfit. Hi, thank you for the cool outfit. We now have all our snow clothes. It looks lovely, I agree. Okay, so we gotta get this morphing object, morphing object here, and uh, then we'll carry on. I don't want to go too far and miss it. Now she looks like a war maiden. Yes, that's right. Let me see here. Where is that uh, view? Strategy guide. See what we got here. So apparently it's up in the roof somewhere. Okay. Up high. Somewhere around here. Oh, there it is. Found it. Yeah, we look good in the snow clothes. I agree. And the other one was up here somewhere. Where was it? Uh, thought it was up here. Oh, maybe it was around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Found it. Now, let's just check the map and then we will move forward. Looks like we've gotten everything we needed to get. I love the way they do this map, by the way. Really, I like it. It's almost like chapters, right? Chapter one, chapter two. I think we're ready for the frozen mountains. Let's go. Look, 
A statue on horseback. Time for us to find out what this is all about. Whoa, dude. This isn't a statue, but a frozen rider from Ron's squad. Who did this to him? I must melt the ice quickly. Yes, the morphs are cleverly disguised. I agree. Oh, dude. I feel so bad for you, buddy. Lovely rocks. Look at the sky. It looks awesome. Did anyone look at the moon last night? The moon was incredible. They're it was like, still breathing. The moon was like an orangey yellow last night. Quick, go through his stuff. Steal it. Steal it. <laughs> 